Hello guys, my name is Tara from Tara Arts Tutorial and welcome to another cool tutorial. And today I'm going to be teaching you how to do the green screen effects in Photoshop CS5. Um, well, you can do it also in the recent version of Photoshop, but I mean I'm using CS5 right here. So, the thing that you're going to want to do, of course, you're going to import your files or your photo with the green screen. So, you're going to double click in this area and then you're going to find the pictures with a green screen let's say this man over here and then we're gonna go to oh wait a minute the first thing I want to do is you go to make sure you go to layers and as you can see this photo means these layers is locked so you're gonna unlock it by double click it and then click OK so you unlock it and you're gonna go to select color range and then make sure you hold down hold down hold down shift make sure you hold down shift and then click the green screen area you can just click it you know click click or you can just uh, hold the left click of the mouse and select all the green area make sure your um, object is not wearing any green shirt or whatever that is so because it will also select it so click OK and just click delete on your keyboard and there you go you just make a green screen effects in Photoshop um, actually it's chroma keying I mean so next thing you're gonna do maybe you're gonna add some pictures for the background so just drag it to the Photoshop and then I'm gonna copy this photo control C back to this composition control V means you're gonna paste it but my picture is kinda big so I'm gonna hold down uh, I'm gonna hit Ctrl T means transform and hold down shift again so the aspect ratio will not change and make it small Ctrl minus for zoom out so you can see how big the picture is and hold down shift and there you go if you want to bring it back oops sorry if you want to bring it back to the smaller size again I meant to zoom in Ctrl plus and there you go you just create a green screen effects hit enter if you're done and then you're probably gonna color correct it so it will match the screen you can use an adjustment layer and a color balance and make sure you hit this so it will just um, the effects will be appear only in these pictures uh, below it so as you, as you can see the background is kind of greenish so we're gonna make it greenish also and I find it pretty good and then yes that's actually already looking good so there you go you just create a nice green screen effects alright guys so my name is Tara from Tara Arts um, tutorial and if you find this useful subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and see you in the next cool tutorials ciao this, this, this is our baby.